He's like, is that Yu-Gi-Oh? Watch this. Ripped out his Yu-Gi-Oh card, bro. It's like a laminated piece of paper. And he's like, it's me. Why is he holding it? He has it in his wallet. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> we call That's him, weird, bro. We call him MacGyver. <laughs> so he can fucking do anything. Oh. Switch on. Switch on. We are back. We are back, ladies and gents. Is this on episode 30? Oh, fuck, it's episode 30. No way, It's episode 30, dude. dude. Fuck. Welcome, welcome to, uh, we're in the trifectas. In the trifectas. How good does that feel? We're in the Splash Bro step. Woo! Curry. I thought three felt good. Yeah. 30. 30. Add a no to something, makes it way better. You know, right now, 30 feels good, but I won't three years down the track, 30's not going to feel good. It's not going to feel good. Yeah. Yeah. Because we'll be 30. Yeah. Well, yeah. hopefully it just feels like this and, you know, good there's vibes. no difference, but, yeah. um, yeah, welcome guys. Welcome <coughs> to Senpai Some Guy. Um, the best of the best. I mean, like, you got Joe Rogan podcast that we say every time. We're, we're this close. We're this close. We're this close, we're yeah. this close to yeah. beating him out. I'm only rated 270 <laughs> out of any. 2 million yeah, it's podcasts. Not bad. So not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. There's a lot of podcasts out there, and let me just tell you, have they ever even gotten to episode 10, let alone episode mm. fucking 30? Yes, we got close to not doing that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the flood split us apart. Check it out. That's one of our videos. Flood split us apart. The climatic yeah. the climactic end of phase one. <laughs> of phase <laughs> one, yeah. <sighs> yeah Season three's been going pretty good, though. Dude, we've been consistent with Season you guys. Season three's been pretty good. Giving them everything. Yeah. Giving them some, some juice, some ripe uh, oranges to oranges, squeeze. Oranges, yeah, squeeze, squeeze. Squeeze some... Squeeze some orange peels so in your brother good. or sister's eye. See what happens. Um, I haven't watched. I know I am up to date. So anime wise, I haven't really been. There's nothing really out yet. Yeah. To yeah. like nothing new. So it all be, all the stuff we're watching at the moment would probably be like <coughs> recaps or looking back on old animes. Or yeah, you got like 100%. what he's going to talk about today, yeah. which is a I'm thrilling like topic between the anime <laughs> anime community <laughs> between the, the oldies and the newies and the newbies. Yeah. Um, but besides the you know weekly releases. Um, you probably know what I'm talking about now. One Piece and uh, yeah, Burritos one one week released one week. Yeah, yeah well, it ended two weeks ago. Oh, or a, we- a week ago, yeah. I think okay. it ended a week ago. Like phase one, so phase two. Phase one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this episode's called Phase One. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. know how like um, Naruto had Phase One, and it was like OG Naruto, and then there was like Shippuden. Shippuden. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. So I think that's what's gonna happen. We're gonna so they're gonna age him up. Yeah. Okay. And it's gonna be badass. Burrito looks pretty evil, man. What? Him and himself. Yeah. 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 It's pretty badass. He looks bad, man. Yeah. Looks like a bad guy. <laughs> well, he's not. But he's going through some bad shit at the moment, man. Fuck. We like to start with that? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Start with it, man. Let's start. Um, Come on, Baruto. So the anime ended last week and it ended on Baruto getting killed by mm-hmm. his brother, Kawaki. And Kawaki's like, not his brother, brother, but it's like they, Naruto found him, took him in. And pretty much put him in his family, and then Boruto and Kawaki became brothers. You know, like okay, that's cool. Tight as fuck. Yep, yep, yep. <coughs> but they've got powers. They've got. They're like, um, they've got these codes of fucking Otsutsuki, which are like the godlike shinobi or whatever godlike beings in Naruto. Mm-hmm. And Boruto's one keeps taking him over, and Boruto almost kills Naruto, and Kawaki's like, you know, Naruto's his god. Yeah, he's okay. like, I'll yeah, do yeah, anything yeah, yeah. for him. I want him to be yep, safe, yep, shit yep. like that. So, Borodo got his conscience back and he's like, do it, brother. And then Kwaki came in, fucking stabbed him in the chest. Killed his Ooh, ass. Fuck yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's where the anime ended. But What's his name? Kawaki. Kawaki, yeah. Sounds Weird like a name. duck, man. Yeah. Kawaki. Kawaki. <laughs> yeah. Kawaki, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, when in the manga, though, no, um,. Momoshiki, who's the Otsutsuki that took over Boruto, mm-hmm. revives him okay. and loses his chance at reviving himself. So what they do is they enter their mm-hmm. code into someone so they can revive later down the line. They take over that person's body. Yeah. But he used too much of his power to revive Boruto that he can no longer revive. True. Yeah. Weird. Yeah. And um, I'm so, like, not in two, even Naruto. Yeah. I know a bit more Naruto than Boruto, but... yeah. Boruto, yeah, just took it to the next level. Um, so at the moment, the latest chapter, fucking crazy. It sent the world into frenzy. 
Talk um, about it, man. What what <laughs> what took the world into frenzy? Go. So the start of Boruto is Kawaki and Boruto on top of the Hokage Mountain about to fight, and Boruto's like, you know, give me back my dad. Where'd you put my dad? Shit like that. And he's like, you're never gonna see your dad again. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> you'll never see your dad again. No one, no one kind of knew how it got to that. Mm. But in the manga, oh, so it's like it starts somewhere, and then you have to go lead up to that. Yeah. Oh, okay. So that's literally, cool. it starts at that, and then Boruto tells you his story, mm. and people are like, "That's weird that it goes back in time and tells his story." But the latest chapter, fucking explained it all. True. So Kawaki. Um, imprisoned Naruto and Hinata, so Naruto and his wife. They're imprisoned in this, like, fucking capsule thing that he's got power for, and they can't age and shit, and everyone thought that Naruto's dead. Kawaki was on the run. Um, everyone was trying to get him. He tried to kill Sasuke's daughter. Mm. Boruto protected her, got a scar on his eye, got his eye cut out, got fucked up, and then... He was going, he was going, then there's this chick that's in love with Kawaki. She's got badass powers. Kawaki. <laughs> Kawaki. <laughs> Kawaki. Keep going. Keep going. Um, yeah, she's in love with him. She's got cool powers. He's pretty much said, I wish that um, I was, you know, Naruto's son and that Boruto was, you know, was Boruto that had to go through the shit that he's going through. Mm. So her power made it that Boruto was the one that killed Naruto and Hinata, and he was the outsider brought in by Naruto. Oh. So he's no longer his son. He's just Boruto. But True. Kawaki is Naruto's son. Everyone thinks Kawaki is his son now. What the fuck? So, yeah, the only one that isn't, like, under the spell is Sasuke's daughter, Sarada. So I don't know where it's going to go from here. I think there's a little break, but pretty much Boruto's an outsider. He's on his own. Everyone in the Leaf Village Hates is him. hunting him. Oh, true. Trying to kill him. And Kawaki is back in. So is Kawaki the bad one? Yeah. Because he's the son of, like, a bad person, right? Kawaki? Yeah. Nah, he's... Oh, well, he was, like, an orphan. He was taken in by a oh, bad okay. dude. And he injected himself into him. Oh. Like, you know what I mean? Like, his code. Yeah, okay. Yeah, but Kawaki killed... Um, Naruto and Sasuke killed him, so he couldn't revive. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so shit's getting deep hectic. Shit. Yeah, so... Some deep it, shit, bro. It makes sense why Boruto's going back and telling his story, because in his world... <laughs> No one knows them. That's fucked. Yeah. Imagine that, man. Yeah. Rocking up home, and everyone's like, get the fuck out of my yeah, house, Yeah, get dude. the fuck out. I don't know who you are, man. And there's some what random dude there. Guys, that's literally my ass pillow. That's I'm, your, the, <laughs> I'm your son. You can see my sweat stains you on that pillow. It. Like, the what fuck? do you... Smell it. It's me. It's me. That's not you. That's Ronald. <laughs> Look at my jacket. You bought this for me, mom. In comes Ronald. Hey, man, what you doing in my room? <laughs> <laughs> what you doing what? in my room, man? What the fuck, Ronald? Ronald, we're best friends. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you're my enemy now. You're my enemy. Um, <laughs> I'm the son of this family. I'm the son of this tree trunk. This is my mama, my papa. This right here is my dog. Why don't we say it's southern? Because <laughs> uh, it sounds creepy, yeah. <laughs> I'm Especially sorry. if you soft voice southern it. Yeah, I'm sorry if you're oh. soft southerners. It's kind of like sweet, but if you make it like, ha. <laughs> Yeah. How Ooh. you doing, Chris? Chris, a boost and yeah. With the whistle. Ah, uh, hey, Chris. You know, Me Chris? and that monkey inside your closet are best friends. Yeah, it's weird. Yeah, it's weird. It's good though. It's weird. It's good. So, Baruto, um, you're on the so you're on the Baruto side, man. So, what you're trying to? Well, hang on a minute. Let's just speak clearly here. You are on the Baruto side of the Naruto Baruto battle. Of fans, oh. <laughs> I put him in a tough spot. Uh, no, nah, I think I'll always be on Naruto's side. Boom. It's just like um, the people who are speaking too much on Boruto aren't really like. I would say they're not they educated know. in Naruto. Yeah, you know what I yeah. mean. Like they but might have watched a few fights on YouTube and been like, "Oh yeah, like whatever." Yeah, but, but they don't know the history, the arc of like the characters that led them there. Yeah, and how much, you know, Naruto went through and shit just to get to where it is. Mm. So, yeah, I don't know. People will always have their own little opinions, which they're allowed to have. They're allowed to have, as we uh, referred as, to yeah. on last week's episode. The latest post. On Demon Slayer Stole Our Money. Yeah. Um, opinions are allowed. Yes. You right? I'm still gutted over that, man. 
still what, guts what being there. robbed of yeah. twenty dollars. Actually, yeah. technically forty dollars because 40, yeah. once you buy the popcorn and the drinks, yeah, you're looking at forty dollars. Let me just say it's though, crazy forty dollars. It was a good cinema. It was a great cinema. The it was cinema reclined that we seats. went to. Was really good. Shout them out. No, yeah. it's not shout them out. Yeah, Fuck them. Fuck them. Those people there, they know who they are. They've seen our tickets. <laughs> <laughs> you know you You're watching right you now. You watch us. Yeah, we went there. It. You went crazy. Yeah. Fan, fanboying, fangirling, whatever. It's fine. Mate. You didn't give us a discount, though. Mate. Thank you, guys. Yeah, thank for you. For all that you've done. Thank Appreciate you. If it. If it wasn't for cinema people. Uh, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, um, Jojo. Jojo. Our um, boy, um, yes, if you're asking, like, who's Jojo? Yes, he dresses like the the anime. Yeah. Um, True. Slight hit. Bit sexy. Bit sexy. I can't wait to see it. I didn't get it. Yeah. Um, but he's in your home country, man. True. He's in the NZ. Hells yeah, man. And he... Um, Live it up, bro. It's been sending some pictures, man. You have some nice scenery. Yeah, there's fucking exceptional scenery in New fucking Zealand. Fucking beautiful, man. I was like, fuck. Yeah. Some of the shots of, like, the water, I was like, Shit, that man. literally looks like Lord of the Rings. Yeah, literally, bro. <laughs> it literally is Lord of the Rings. I feel like Peter Jackson went on, like, a little fucking mini holiday there and was just like, shit, man. Isn't he from New Zealand? I'm make a movie here. I thought Peter Jackson's New Zealander. Yeah, but, you know, like, growing up in New Zealand, you don't appreciate it. Oh, uh, I, it's, like, it's like Australia too, man. Yeah, you know, like... Yeah. Like, Northern Terror. Like, I want to see, like, the... Um, um, What's it called? I don't know what they call it anymore. Uluru. Uluru, Uluru yeah. yeah. like I'd love to see Uluru, but I always forget about it, that it's right there. Yeah. But I get it. Because yeah. it's not near any of the main cities. Like, you have to go... Is it South Island? Is that where it is? Or uh, like where all Lord of the Rings was shot? I think it was all over NZ. Oh, okay. But mainly North Island. Oh, okay, cool. Mata Mata. That's where the Hobbiton is. Yeah, that's where he went, bro. He sent a picture. Yeah. And I was like... <laughs> I should have said If I knew... I Although, I will I say, he's something. pretty tall... And the door wasn't that small. Yeah. That's supposed to be built for me. <laughs> <laughs> My people. Well, they built it for the movie, took it down, built it again, took it down. Yeah, didn't it deteriorate? And then they're like, oh, shit. <clears throat> yeah, well, they took it they down because Hobbit, it was yeah. like, it's not land, it's somebody's land. Yeah, gotcha. gotcha. And then they decided to build it and... Keep it. Yeah. It's a good idea. Mm. It's a great idea. It's great yeah. to make money and, you know... It's like a landmark. Yeah. Fucking, like, fucking awesome. Um, so that was cool, man. I've been, it made me want to like, oh, I should go to New Zealand. Yes. Maybe once. Yeah. <clears throat> maybe once. My so partner's <laughs> sister went back and like, they did touristy stuff and I was mm. like, man, fuck, like my home country is mm. fucking gorgeous. Yeah. Let's go to the, let's go to the, um, the outback. The outback. What do you call the outback in New Zealand? It's not outback. What do you call it? Like the great green. The bush. The bush. Is that really <laughs> what you call it? I don't know. Oh. Probably. I feel like the Great Green sounds better. Yeah, the Great Green. Go out to the Great Green. The Great Green in the land of the long white cloud. Oh, that sounds, <laughs> like, a good, that sounds yeah, like a great movie. Yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> Woo! <coughs> you know what that's about? It's about um, how Maui rode the stingray um, and fished out New Zealand, and that's why. That's what how New Zealand was made. Yeah. I know my Woo! history. I know my history. I'll tell you, Roa. Um... Anyways, <laughs> off the New Zealand train. But there you go, guys. If you haven't been to New Zealand, check it out. Go check it out. For New sure. Zealand sponsorship. Yeah, New Zealand sponsorship. Sponsor us. Sponsor <laughs> us. I am a Maldi living in Australia. Where's his centre leg? <laughs> Sponsor me, please. Please. Oh, I need the Benny over here, bro. Come on screen, New Zealand. Yeah. Help us out. Come on, fuck. <laughs> no, we're having a great time. Yeah, great time. I love it. I love, love it in Australia. I love it. I love you guys too. Thanks for listening. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I've been watching a good show. Okay. Now, this is technically Among Us. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. But it's a live adaptation. It's a show. Yep. But it's not It's not a, like, shonen. It's a, um, what would you call it? Is it seinen? No. So it's adult? Oh, yeah, it's adult. It's, like, relationship. It's just a relationship-based uh, uh, manga. Yes. Uh, I don't know what you'd call it. Slice of, not slice of life, I guess, but mm, I don't know. Romance. Romance. It's know. really, it's got, it's really cute. Right. Um, it's called a uh, full time wife escapist, oh. and it's about um, this girl in Japan. Um, I'll just do a, a slight synopsis because I don't want to ruin all like the cute, mo- like the yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, know I what I mean? You. I don't want to yeah. ruin the story for you guys because you have to go on that journey. Yeah, it's, and if you watch it with someone, it's even better because you're Facts. like, you're like fucking. Oh, that's fucking cute. Hell yeah. Um, 
so pretty much about this girl who's working in corporate Japan and she gets fired from her job right and on. she's kind of like, all right, she doesn't know what she's good at kind of thing. Yeah. Um, she's just looking for a job and then she ends up just doing like housekeeping job. Like her dad got it onto this dude that just needs a house cleaned like uh, I think like rich. throughout the one week. Um, well, he's a um, software Rich. He's like he's like a introvert software um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. engineer kind of dude. Rich, but um, yeah, but very like particular OCD, quiet, self kept, everything yeah. like that. Yeah, and then so she's cleaned the thing, the house, and then her family is going to start moving. They're gonna, pretty much their fam- the parents going to retire, and she doesn't have a place to stay. She lives with them. They can move to the country. Oh yeah, and so she can stay there, and that he can keep his cleaner. Um, because in Japan, obviously the social structure, if, sh- if she's just living with him, it just looks bad. Yeah. So they, they do a contractual marriage. <laughs> what? So pretty much she, her job is to clean the house. She yeah. gets paid a salary and they stay there and they pretend to be married to oh, make yeah. the norm. So yeah, he yeah, keeps yeah. Cause, <clears throat> Cause she's the only one to be able to keep his house clean, like the way he likes it. Yeah. And then pretty much, that's pretty much where it starts. And then. Obviously they fall in love. And then, oh man, it's fuck it. So good. What's dude. it called again? Um, I'll have to get you the message. Full time wife escapist. Great like couple show. Yeah, is it on Netflix? Yeah. Hell yeah. Um, this is cute, man. It kind of reminds me of like Lizzie McGuire. True. Like, uh, it's got these little moments where she's like in her head, like talking to herself. Yeah. Because like, and then it's which is what they're doing. In Among Us, yeah, 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 and like, but they do it well enough that you kind of like you just go with it. Like this is on the nose, but yeah. It's fucking funny. It's yeah, actually like the yeah. first Japanese show I've watched and I was like, they've like got the humor parts. Yeah. Like really funny. Fuck yeah. Yeah. It was not forced or anything like that. I have to check it out. Dude, check it out guys. Full Time Wife Escape is on Netflix. I guarantee you, you won't like, it's like an emotional roller coaster. Fuck yeah. And you're like, yes. Gotta love it. Yeah. And they do like bases, like being in a relationship. They like hit those moments. They just hit those, like, the ups and downs moments, the weird moments, those stupid moments. They, like, hit it, and then you're like, fuck. They yeah. fucking nailed that. So relatable. Yeah. Hell yeah. So that was great. Nice. Yeah. Oh, oh, definitely I'm going to check that out. Check it out, guys. Yeah. Trust me. I've Adam and Laura onto it. Yeah. Love it. They, they're hooked now. Fuck yeah. I have to and it's only one season, and then the second season's, like, a two-hour movie. Cool. So it's only, it's like a quick... Yeah. Quick doing that a lot down. Hey, oh, I love it, man. Yeah. Because you don't have to be... You don't have to commit to fucking five seasons or whatever, whatever it is. Yeah, oath. let's be honest. By the fifth season, sh- shit usually like gets a bit shit. Yeah. No yeah. offense to my boy Stephen Amell, but after season two, Arrow were like it was shit, went shit. Um, which we're not going to see, guys, because we're not going to be at Gold Coast Supernova. Sadly, because our sexy man dog yeah. isn't going to be there, and um, we could do it, but I mean, I just can't be bothered. Yeah. <laughs> And it wouldn't be the same. It wouldn't be the same without like, Mando. Um, credit to Manny. Like a lot of, <clears throat> a lot of our confidence came from Manny in our mm. first Supernova video. You know, there was a lot of times where we were feeling deflated and not knowing what to do in Manny's direction. And words yeah. of encouragement were really like necessary for us to get through that day. Yeah, we love and you, Manny. Yeah, we appreciate it. We love you, man. It's also Manny's birthday on the sixteenth. My birthday's on the fourteenth, so he's had something planned. I was going to go there, but it was like a bit rushed. Yeah. And, but we'll do Brisbane again. This is better. Yeah, fair enough. Works out. The home, the home city. That's the home turf, son. the home city. But if you're at Gold Coast, you want us to head out, maybe, maybe I will just go to Supernova for the day and say hello. Yeah, maybe just for like a chill. Just for a chill. So just, if you want us to come, just hit us up in the comments. If not, we're not going to go. Yeah. (laughs) So, um, but uh, that's the way the cookie crumbles. That's the way the cookie crumbles. don't forget it. Yeah, Um, because things going, eh? Who, man? Stephen Black Amell's going, yeah. True. Yeah, that's why I was like... I thought Black Canary it. was going. I think she's too. She's Dude, they've going, got, yeah. They've got heaps of people going to the True. Gold Coast one. Fucking hell, no way Stephen Amell's going. Yeah, I know. Oh, I'm going to have to make an appearance. You have to go? Yeah, just to look at him. Just yeah. like when we went to, to look see. at Manu Burnett. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah. God, he was he's so sexy too. Like, got stunned. You guys don't understand, we were frothing. Yeah, it was bad. Like, as he walked past... Like not in front of us either. He was, <laughs> he was just like, like hundred yeah, meters. He was away, a while dude. away, like but fifty like meters maybe. He caught our eye and we just literally yeah. time stopped and we we're just staring. I don't at know him. if you've ever done that. You like look at someone and they look at you and you're like, holy shit. And then he 
acted not weird about it. Yeah. And we acted really, really weird. weird. Yeah, super weird. <laughs> really weird yeah. about it. Like, I'm pretty sure we both had trouble taking out fucking, taking a piss. I definitely had trouble. Because, <laughs> 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 tell you what. Have you heard of the boat together. term? you heard of the boat term? No, what's the boat term? Half mast. Oh, yes. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. Half-mast. If you guys get it at home. Yeah. Yeah, put a flag <laughs> in full the comments. Full Not mass. a red flag, yeah. just a flag. Full mass peeing is a tricky situation for all of you. Yeah. Don't we all <laughs> understand yeah. that? A little bit of a plank action. That morning. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of plank action. I go for know? like the bend over sometimes. Yeah. You know, you have to like hold it down and kind of lift your hips up. Yeah. You know, it just depends on the mood. Yeah. It depends how awake I am. I sometimes like I'll just piss on the floor. I'll just piss in my mouth. I like to squat <laughs> facing the back of the toilet and hold on to the back of the toilet and just raise my butt into the air. <laughs> <laughs> just full. Mm? Everyone's like imagining that, right? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Great. Monkey man. Hey, man, you got to change tactics sometimes. Yeah. And I like that. That's that's imagination. It's good, yeah. Ingenuity. It's a good time. It's a great time. It's always a fun time. <laughs> Wouldn't be so far if some guy without penis to look. Yeah, no penises. Well, we just first time we said it. All penises. We should try one episode not to say it. Yeah. Well, we we lasted a lot longer than five minutes, so it's quite been well. Like, it's been, it's like, been 20, like twenty minutes. Yeah. Twenty minutes. So, guys, if you're lucky, <laughs> if you're lucky, next you time you won't hear the word. You haven't had penis thrown at you all the time. <laughs> <laughs> if, you're like a, if you're like a girl walking past some tradies, everyone's just throwing the penis. Yeah. And then they're which is bad. Away. Screw you guys. Yeah. Give us a bad name. Yeah, dudes. Yeah. Is, that a, is you know what's awkward? Grow up. Uh, awkward. <laughs> fucking someone shoot me. In my foot. <laughs> in my foot. <laughs> Not deadly. Just um, take off a toe. Just take off a toe. Yeah. I can do without a pinky toe. Yeah, pull a Joe Goldberg. Um, like when someone says something and then you're next to them and then that person looks at you. Oh, yeah. And then you have to like... Like, they want you to, like, check that person, and you're like, fuck, man, I don't even know this dude. Like, I'm just... Standing here. I don't, like, want to fight. I don't want to... Yeah. St- you know? But you... Fuck, those dudes are annoying. Yeah, for sure. Just, and they're usually, they're usually old dudes. Yeah. To be honest. And, like, warehousing, you always have fucking old dudes that do it. Yeah. Relax, dudes. Relax, okay? man. Get the fuck out Ain't of here. Ain't nobody yourself. want you. Yeah. Like, and, and you saying that? Somebody definitely. will, but just be romantic about it, you know? Yeah, but I don't think, like, a chick walking across the street. Oh, yeah, street. no, not like that, yeah. But, like, someone you find in your life, yeah. Well, like yeah. You will, like, find Go a date, partner. have some talks. Yeah, you just put a bit of effort in. Yeah. Um, and you will, but I have just... Have a shower. You know, you know, I don't think whistling is the way. Yeah, no. <laughs> I don't think it's the way. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, if you did a, a poll, maybe we should do a poll on Instagram, like, does whistling attract you yeah. to women? I don't, I, think, I don't think it'd come back positive. No. Uh, yeah. I think it'll be a very negative post. Although I will say, if you just start hip hop dancing in front of them, different reaction. Yeah, don't know what the reaction will be. Chris Brown, yo. But if I saw an old dude start dancing to "Take You Down," yeah, by Chris Brown, killing do it, do killing it, do do dude. What are you gonna do? do some guy just starts glide. Some like fifty year old just starts gliding. Yeah, and you're like, shit, man, goddamn, all right, you fucking usher. all right. I'll give you whatever you want. Whatever you want, man. I'll take you for a drink. Yeah, hell yeah. Because um, you're them. always down. I'm some, always down for some brewskis. <laughs> some brewskis, <laughs> always, <laughs> always down for some brewskis. Well, not at the moment. No, no I am. I am always. Yeah, down. I'm always down for brewskis. Yeah. Someone hits me up, you know. Brewskis, brewskis. Yeah. Here's some bears, man. I have some bears. Oh, some <laughs> bro. Whoo. Those strong zeros, man. In Japan, oh yeah. dude, nine percent. Fuck yeah, bro. Nine percent. All day. That's fucked, dude. Yeah, I could do this all day. You could do it all day. Yeah. You could have me strong zeros, could you do, in Japan? Not 77 or 78. That's the death of Bailey Drake. <laughs> <laughs> People have, like, one of those, and they're, like, done. Yeah. But apparently Westerners drink them, like, they drink them here. True. And then they... Get fucked up. They fucking die. Not yeah. die, but, you know. What a way to ruin your trip. Yeah. <clears throat> you go to Japan, you're all happy, and then you get, like, su- like extremely, like... Hungover with alcohol poisoning. Fuck yeah! And you were like, "Damn, good memory." But sounds also like a good trip. <laughs> 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 sounds like my kind of place. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> um, 
talking about drinks, I went on my two year anniversary a few weeks ago. Congratulations, mate. Thanks, mate. Um I have never had Long Island iced tea. Never had one. You've never had life. one? I've never had one. And my partner ordered a jug of Long Island iced tea. <laughs> oh jeez. Let's just man. say they hit pretty Did hard. Did you drink it through a straw? And they were fucking delicious. Hell yeah, I drank it through a straw, man. Bro. That's my that's my go out drink. Yeah. Because oh. you spend twenty bucks, right? Yeah. But you have two. You're good. Yeah. You're good. You drink through a straw, you are good for the night. I had about five glasses. Fuck. <laughs> Yeah, not big ones though. They're like this oh, size. Yeah. They're like this size oh, okay. glasses. Oh, the ones that are like, yeah, like the long ones. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's like four probably. But yeah, yeah. Um, Vapiano's, hey. You went to Vapiano's. Fancy. Yeah, fuck, it's good, bro. I love so Vapiano's, good. man. Um, we got some pasta with like chicken and bacon in it. Fuck, man. So good. Went so hard, like mm. chicken and pasta sauce was such. It felt like such a taboo for mm. me. You know, like chicken should be with like a white. Pasta sauce, you know, like cream, creamy. But this one came with like a red pasta sauce, and it was fucking amazing. It's your Italian heritage. It you? blew my mind, man. You're like, you hit a gene, and it was like, this I'm is like, meant oh, to be. Fuck, this is. Oh, what did the um chicken taste like? Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Just I was gonna say something. Like snake, <laughs> alligator. I don't know. Just wondering, man. Tasted like success. Ooh, nice, dude. Tasted yeah. like success. <laughs> Tastes like the right thing at the right time, dude. Yeah, man. So, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. Everywhere else we wanted to go was closed. More like full. Where Where else did you want to go? Um, TGI Fridays, Milky Lane. What day did you go? Bro, we went Friday night. What? TGIF was closed. Oh, it was full. Oh, okay. Yeah. And, uh, well, it was St. Paddy's weekend. Dude, Blackbirds. Yeah. Mm. I was in the Gold Coast. Oh, okay. I'll yeah. tell you that. Eagle Street. No, nah, I was at Gold Coast. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was. T- it was. Um, I do not know then. Paddy's, St. Paddy's weekend. Oh, so it was like packed to the cracked, brim with yeah. people green. Felt That's, like a gangland war. That sounds like a pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool night out. Everyone's happy. Right. There was a lot of people around. Surely there was some people fighting. Another. Yeah. <laughs> Down at the Irish stadium. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking Irish people. Yeah, gotta love them. They're everywhere. Conor Literally. McGregor. Everywhere, like everyone's probably Irish. Yeah. Even the people that don't think they're Irish, you're probably Irish. I'm hella Scottish. You got Scottish in you? Braveheart. Yeah. Yeah. I've got everything. Hell yeah. I've got everything, man. Same. Yeah. Trust I'm me. a. Uh, yeah. Trust I'm a me. bit of a chameleon. You know. You don't, you don't believe me, mate. I believe you. Lick me. See what I taste like. See what it tastes like. You won't. You won't know. Yeah. Flavors from all over the fucking world. You'll be like, I don't know. I put my finger on it. Yeah. And I'll be like, exactly, bitch. Exactly. I am who I am, and you are who I came you up, are. I came up with a. Um, I, uh, like a theory Yeah I guess you'd call it yeah. Hypothesis Let's call it a hypothesis Hypothesis always sounds fucking sick You can't get in trouble For a hy- hypothesis Okay Because no. it's just It's just a thought Yeah it's, it's a brain a thought. thought Yep It's it's a test experiment Yeah I didn't So not me thinking down. this It's just It's a thing okay? Yeah It's right a on. thing that is here But not here Okay Yep um, So I was thinking right Why Because if you go through history Okay Yeah there was so many cultures that did slavery. Portugal, um, Irish people were enslaved. I uh, like to do labor and stuff like that yeah. for ages. You probably had the Romans, the Greeks who enslaved. You had the Mongols. You had Indians. Indians. Oh, did Indians slave? No, they were. I think they were colonized. Did they slave at one point? Maybe. Probably. No, not the American Indians. Oh, the American Indians. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. No. No. Like. Yeah, actual Indians. Oh yeah, did they enslave? People. I don't know, like, what? No, like, I thought you were saying. Oh, no, no, slaves. sorry. I mean, people that did enslave, sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because um, you got the, yeah, the Mongols, Genghis Khan, obviously, yeah. would have enslaved people. Yeah. Um, you probably got the Chinese during the um, Chizu dynasty. Dynasty, dynasty yeah. yeah. You probably got Japan. Definitely yeah, Japan. Definitely Japan. Um, so you got all these countries, right? And I was like, I was like, okay, why, why do white people still get, like, you know, they always, always get, like, like, they can't be forgiven kind of thing for it. Yeah. And I figured it out. Mm. They have shit food. <laughs> shit food. They have shit food, bro. <laughs> oh, there's your answer. <laughs> like, 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 when was the last time someone said, man, I really feel like some white food? <laughs> <laughs> there is no white food. How many times have you gone, guys, Chinese food? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Even Irish, I mean, I mean, they sell potatoes, so unfortunately you don't get any. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Irish have beers, though. But you got... 
Yeah, that's true. But yeah. everyone has beers. Yeah. Like, so it's not enough. Yeah. Because people don't, everyone likes beers. Yeah. Weirdos. Yeah. But not everyone likes beers. They also have proper 12. Mongolia. Mongolian beef. Yeah. Fucking nice. Ain't nobody going to hate on Mongolian beef. No. Okay. So that's my conclusion. I have a fi- I just, it has to be food. Yeah. They just haven't done enough. Like Italians don't get anything. Mm. Rome. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Italian food. Yeah. Don't get any shit. They kind of get put out. They're kind of in a weird, they get put in like a weird section where they're like, they're not white, but they are white, but they're not, but they get to stay there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They're in the middle. They, get, they can claim something. Like, yeah. Yeah. Um, so it's, uh, it's got to be food guys. You tell me what you think. Food. Is it the food? <clears throat> um, uh, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> this is hypothesis done. Uh, that was yeah. uh, given to me by Jeremy, Jeremy Kane. Um, um, on Instagram. It's a fake name. Don't look up Jeremy Kane. <laughs> Did not abuse him. I was going to say, just like <laughs> fucking... <laughs> oh, who's calling me? Threw man? him out there. Don't worry, this won't come up on the thing. Yeah, I noticed, I noticed that, eh? <sighs> All right. We're going to go soon. Yeah, we should... Yeah. All right. Sorry, guys. This will be a quick one today. Yeah. Because uh, um, I've got to go soon. Your man's got things to do. He's got a, you know, he's got an actual job. I've got an actual job. Do you know, this isn't okay. our job. Yet. Yet. One day. One day. We'll be all yours, baby. Yeah, all yours. Um, but until then, guys, um, thank you for listening to this point on, if you have. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow. Shout out to our new listeners, too. Yeah, shout out to our new listeners. All our new listeners. Give us a Appreciate review you. on Apple Podcasts or whatever you're listening to us on. Hell Helps yeah. a lot. Yep. Um, share us around. Um Um, help us grow and then we can give more to you guys through content and everything like that so without further ado right on um thank you guys um this has been episode 30 of senpai with some guy arigato gozaimasu arigato gozaimasu but they don't say that when they finish eating anyway another time another time time. okay next time three two one bye Bye. fucking wiggles finger (laughs) 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 (la